Courtney Cox here for Nesson.com and to continue the theme of the Olympics we are here at the Andover YMCA with Anna Synchro to learn a little bit more about synchronized swimming. Yes, that's right. I'm going to jump in the pool. I'm going to talk to some of the team, some of the coaches and learn a little bit more about the sport. I really grew up doing the sport and I really loved it. I saw one of the shows and I thought it was really, really cool, so I wanted to try it out. We have the team events, which is a large group. It's four more swimmers together. They go above water and do arms. And then you have the smaller events, which are trios, duets, and solos. Last season, I swam a team routine and a duet, and this year I'm swimming a team routine, a duet, and a combo. It's called Egg Beater and synchronized swimmers and rugby players use it. It looks like an egg beater when they twirl around itself, your legs like move around itself. We have to put gelatin in our hair, which definitely isn't my favorite part, but I do like competing and like wearing the cool suits and putting makeup on. When you go to meets, you put your hair up and you use gelatin, or um, Knox, you use it to make jello. You put your hair up in like a ballerina bun, and we have like a decoration that goes over it. And then the makeup usually has to be kind of large and bright and colorful because the judges are so far away. The top countries, we like Spain, pretty um, competitive country. I think the U.S. looks pretty good this year. I think they have a really good shot, a shot at doing well because I've been, like recently I've been watching like a lot of their like videos from past meets and I think that they have a really good shot. 